Hello everybody! You are probably watching this video because you will be doing a lab practical soon. So here are the top 12 lab safety rules. Remember, our goal is to prevent accidents. Rule number one, always walk in the lab. There is no need to hurry. Get your materials, equipment and apparatus safely to your work area. If not, Don't. this is what is going to happen. Kaboom! Rule number two, listen to the teacher. If you are not sure, ask questions. It is better to ask than to make a mistake later on. Rule number three, never touch, smell, or taste anything unless your teacher tells you to. Number four, don't eat or drink in the science lab. Don't. Rule number five, always wear safety goggles, even if you wear glasses. If you have long hair, tie it back. Rule number six, always report accidents and breakages to your teacher or lab technician immediately. Do not touch the broken glass. Your teacher or the lab technician will take care of it. Take note that broken glass should be put in the broken glass bin. Rule number seven, if you use too much of a certain chemical, do not return it to its stock container to avoid contamination. If this happens, use a dropper or spatula to remove the excess chemical and put it in the designated chemical waste bin. Rule number eight, if you get chemicals in your eyes, rinse your eyes with water for 15 minutes. The science labs have eye wash bottles. If you can't find any, go to the nearest sink and use the tap to rinse your eyes. If you get chemicals on your skin, rinse with water for 15 minutes. Rule number 9. Let's talk about fire safety. When using the Bunsen burners, do not play with the lighters or lit Bunsen burners. If something catches on fire, Tell the teacher or the lab technician immediately. Take note that aside from water, there are other items in the lab you may use to extinguish or put out the fire, such as the fire blanket, fire extinguisher, and sand bucket. Rule number 10. Return materials, equipment, and apparatus to their proper places. Used apparatus must be put in their designated bins and not back in the cabinets. This is to prevent contamination. Rule number 11. After cleaning up, wipe the benches, those are the tables, just so you know, with disinfectant. Rule number 12, always wash your hands at the end of a lab activity. Okay, boys and girls, I hope you take these rules to heart. Practicing lab safety is better than dealing with accidents. And those, boys and girls, are the top 12 lab safety rules. Bye-bye.